Yo, it's Duff of the Cloud Chaser TV, man. We back up in this thing again, you dig? Hey, man, we got some news to report, man. 600, man. 600. We been talking about Buddy for a little minute, you feel me? He got a lot to say about different members from his neighborhood, you feel me? He was just in the hood yesterday, y'all. I'll play that footage in a minute. He was just in the hood. Did nobody touch that nigga 600? He said he liked that, you feel me? He liked that. He a boxer. 600 but let's get to it though man like i, I know y'all been wondering because he said something to me man and i actually correct him he was talking about the california law that took place in 2023 july only thing is 600 your paperwork was different and when bro 2013 when they sealed it so why the fuck they sealed it 10 years prior to <laughs> the law bro you got some explaining to do man once again you know, these dudes is calling around, you know, trying to document things and document gang activity for whatever reason. You know what I'm saying? So my hood, my whole hood know what we was doing. You know what I'm saying? We pull up Maybachs, you know what I'm saying? Cadillac trucks and Phantoms. You know what I'm saying? Let me, let me pause it right there. We we seen 600 pull up in no Maybachs, man. You know what I'm saying about? But I haven't seen that nigga pull up in the Maybach in months. He ain't been smoking no cigar in that Maybach like Shug, man. I think Buddy think he should. But you got to know what come with it. Regular shit. The hum, the big homies is uh, uh, frying turkeys. You know what I'm saying? So we pull up. It's probably like, you know, 20 of us. You know what I'm saying? I'm just frying turkeys. My foot's pulling up, getting their turkeys. Because the next day, Thanksgiving. It's probably like 7.30, 8 o'clock. Wasn't too early. Wasn't too night. But you know what I'm saying? I went live. I put all this shit on live on my Instagram. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he and he did. Was calling like, man, what's up, man? What y'all doing, man? Man. So it's probably like 20 of us. You know what I'm saying? Shout out my big bro. Little Pee Wee from Foley's. You know what I'm saying? So two Foley's pulled up. You know, my niggas. You know what I'm saying? They, they grew up in the hood. So, you know, it's good. It's, and like I say, I'm not even on that type of time. But that's not the moral story. This nigga Big U at it again, bro. More to the story. He lying again. Just like he lied on Big U. He still ain't produced that paperwork. You feel me? Now, look, man. This is Street Channel. So we definitely going to be reporting certain shit. We're not trying to hug all in people politics. That's for sure. But listen to this, though, bro. He was in the hood. I'm going to give him that. Listen. I'm rolling. So what kind of? Hey, get that before me. <laughs> Go inside the thing. <laughs> Mind you, this song Thanksgiving. This is a holiday. You know what I'm saying? A lot of gangsters like to be inside on holidays. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. It's it's bad when a motherfucker die on a holiday. You hear me? Real talk, man. Let's keep it a buck. That's what he was on, y'all. He said he was in the hood. This is bro. Only thing, asking- though, 600 got some explaining to do with this one part, right? How he's saying that his case got sealed in 2023, July. What's That's that? when that law went in effect. You feel me? But it's not true. It's not true at all, 600. So here's the thing, man. This is the challenge for you. Because I know you like to give out challenges and shit, right? This is the challenge to you, 600. I'm going to keep it a buck, bro. Go ahead and pull out your paperwork, bro. That unsealed document. That you got that's sealed on our behalf. We can't see it. The public, the general public can't see that document, bro. Pull it out. Pull it out. This shit got sealed in 2013, man. That law didn't take effect till July of 2023. That's 10 years later. So your shit was sealed beforehand. That's what I'm saying, bro. Shit a little different. Like 600. We ain't finna attack you. I know you said some things in regards to... The last live we had going on, you know what I'm saying? Me personally, I wouldn't attack you at all. You know what I'm saying? That's just how I roll. You feel me? But at the end of the day, bro, you got opportunity to come on this live. The link is in the description to tell us what's really going on. Why your shit was sealed in 2013, bro? And it's 2023. Oh, his shit got sealed before that law went in effect. Look it up. 600. Fuck looking it up. It's your paperwork. You got the opportunity to present it in front of us. If it was just a little petty ass weed case like you say, it shouldn't be nothing for you to unseal that document and show us, you know what I'm saying, what's going on. But let's get to it, gang. That's all we saying, 600. You saying that the reason that your record was sealed because of that law. Now pay attention, y'all. Shout out Byron Blake. The problem with that is 
your case got sealed in 2013. So how does a law that didn't go in effect until July 2023 have an effect on your case all the way back in 2013? It just don't make sense, bro. Then he going look, so far hold as on, to hold say on. That Let me take it back. people who calling him Let out. Let me take it back a little bit so y'all can see it. 2023 have an effect on your case all the way back in 2013. It just don't make sense, bro. 822, then, 2013. going so far as to say that the people who calling him out about this have fifth grade educations. No, my nigga, we just got common sense and we not going to allow you to tell us something and say that is one thing when we can see clearly that it's something else. This new law doesn't even apply to your situation because your case was sealed in 2013. He keeps trying to revert the attention from this situation back to somebody else. This has nothing to do with anybody else's paperwork. Nothing to do with anybody else. Not WAC 100. Not Big U. Not Tupac. Not Keefe D. The list goes on. Brick Baby. Spider Loke. You want me to keep going? We talking about you right now. You on the internet calling people rats and calling out saying they paperwork bogus. So we looking into yours. Your paperwork say that you got a written plea agreement and it also say that it's sealed up. We don't want to hear why it's sealed or how it got sealed. We want you to go unseal it so we can see the contents of the plea agreement and know what's going on. We you don't even got to do that, my boy. All you got to do is show your paperwork. Ain't no sealed in on your end. You the one being tried for the case. Discovery. Ain't no sealed in on your end, bro. Just put it up. Fuck it. Make us all look silly. 600 gonna make us all look silly after this video, gang. <laughs> you don't even know what you're talking about if you're saying a 2023 law is the reason why your case got sealed in 2013. It don't make sense, but just go. That's your paperwork on the screen right now. That's his paperwork, gang. But what about that sealed document? What does it say? It says that you were probably a low-level drug dealer. You sell weed and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm still trying to figure out why would you be trying to get out of a case where you got caught with a, maybe a few pounds or something. I think it was one. But let's just say a few. Let's tell you, my boy. Show that sealed document. Real talk. That's all you got to do, 600. You wanted the clout, right? We got you. Go get the paperwork. Show us the written plea agreement so we can see the contents of that and know what's all in the plea agreement. And that's how you clear your name. You don't clear your name with coming back telling us how the case got sealed or why it's sealed. You go clear your 